Hey guys, Clumsy back with the Tangent Biblio Steve N. Everybody loves this game. Wonderful little card game with this nice little mechanic in the middle where during the action phase you're going to try to get the most points in, in as many of these five areas as you can and you're also going to be able to manipulate the dice to determine exactly what the value for those areas are. And you're going to add up yours versus yours opponents at the end. Now what you have is money cards and then you also have the cards that correspond to these colors that are the most important. The money is used to buy these cards during the game and you've got some special cards that will let you manipulate plus or minus one or two die. Now the first phase is you pick a card in a two-player game. Uh, one gold's the lowest, so you'd probably give that to your opponent. Then you've got to take one for yourself or discard one. Uh, this is a pretty good card, so I'll keep it, and then whatever this is, I have to discard it. It was three gold. So this is a fun game. I want to play with three or four players because the only thing I have a concern with with the two-player game is a lot of times if you're able to draft some of the higher cards, you're able to keep them and then either and basically, you know, never give your opponent any of the valuable cards. You just give them gold usually. And then during the bidding, it's very hard to um, bid for important cards. Usually, uh, we found that if you've had some luck in drafting, you can usually hold on and, and win the game. So that's the only problem I have with the two-player dynamic. I think in the three or four, there's more variability where it's harder uh, to just lock in and make the bidding round less important. But overall, I'm you know, with everyone, a big thumbs up for Biblios, and uh, thanks for joining me on this tangent.